Hey friends, it's Andrew Free Song of Freedom. Welcome back to the warehouse. Today is an unplanned delivery day. This one is a doozy. It was supposed to be here tomorrow. He called me about an hour and goes, said, hey, I'll be there in an hour. Insert panic because today is delivery 21, that's right, 21 pallets of storage, organization, furniture, outdoor items, home decor, and more. 233 items, estimated retail value $24,000. And we want it for about three grand before freight. So he's backing in now. It's a little tight back there. I've got extra boxes that are mine. There's another truck that's over there. So I'm going to try to wiggle everything around. Maybe use shelving units on the wall and uh, make some space. I have another delivery coming tomorrow that I think is one pallet. Actually, might be two one pallet deliveries coming tomorrow. <laughs> Insert panic. All right, let's rearrange. Okay, it's been a while since we've had garage cabinets. So as soon as he opened the doors, what's the first thing I see? Two ish tall garage cabinets. Ta-da! Oh, okay, you guys, everything is unloaded. Everything is haphazardly placed around so I could look at what we've got move the smaller items down the hallway. There's a big box that I know it's smaller things in it, so I'll put it right by our door from not the end so we could just pluck things out and not have like one big massive item. So there's a plan, there's always a plan. I just sometimes change my plan. So it, unloading probably took about 40 minutes and the very nice driver helped me with three pallets total. So those garage cabinets behind me are so tall when they're on the blue pallets that I can't make it through. So we had to take them off the bottom pallet because they were double stacked to shimmy through and there was two of them. So he helped me with that and there was one pallet that all of the contents just kind of shifted to the side. So he helped me with that too. But other than that, not the worst delivery. Come on guys, we've had way worse than this one. This was a walk in the park. But now let me show you. This is what 21 pallets of Home Depot looks like. We've got garage cabinets, we've got beds. We have a cute little stool back there I wanted to sit on. That we've had before, it's a bed, I recognize that. I have not looked in this box. What's in here? Ooh, smaller items and the brown and green ones have some sort of like fake inside plant. We've had those before. I see some kind of red toolbox down here, but it just keeps going. Oh, microwave, that looks brand new. Toolbox, ooh another counter stool. We need kitchen stools at our house. There's a gazebo there that may or may not go to our house. So I'm going to rearrange again, move things down the hallway, which moving things twice is something I don't like to do. It wastes time, wastes energy, but sometimes it's easier to move things down and I want to take a really cool picture. One thing that will slow you down when you're trying to move everything is when the propane tank is empty and you have to change that. I have figured out how to do it. So I'm going to change it now. I did have one of the guys show me how to do it before, but now it's not hard. It just the tank's kind of heavy. So then I can keep working. I managed to move two things before I said, but, 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 I'm dead. <laughs> okay, you guys, it's been a, a few days now, so I have part of the hallway cleared. I actually really liked this delivery once I got everything moved down the hallway and rearranged stuff. We haven't had a delivery like this in quite some time. There's a lot of stools, which I actually took a set of chairs home to our kitchen because when we moved, we had bar, now it's counter, vice versa. And so I can get my little chicken leg to fit in there, but you're on top of the counter. And the ones I brought home, I'm like a toddler and I can't reach the top of the counter. So I'll add a before picture with my little legs, and then the after picture where I can't even see the counter. So I'm gonna bring those back, put them in the auction. I mean, I can tell you how to put them together, so that's fine. But this stuff, we've had a lot of mirrors and people seem to love mirrors and knock on wood, none of that had been broken. We have had in the past more broken toilets and sinks then we have mirrors. Makes no sense to me. And the one is paper thin and really pretty, but let me take you down the hallway a little bit. Look at this clear space. So this one only had, I think 233 units, which is good and bad. It means bigger items, but it's faster to clear the hallway. And if it's a big box like that, and we've had a couple of those, you put them in once, if everything looks the same, put it in its home and you keep on moving. So that's kind of nice. We're actually gonna do two auctions at the same time pretty soon. Our regular ones, which are scheduled Wednesday night to Saturday night. And then I had this great idea of doing a bad mamma jamma auction. Yes, that's what I'm actually gonna call it. And I have saved to the side really good high retail value items. And a few of these have gone into there, I think in that inventory folder in our app, there's 35 things. There's a lot of like Google Nest, a lot of Google different types of stuff, and then garage cabinets, which I had more from this. But I gotta see what else we have. Cause I have behind 
another six pallets were delivered and I have another one coming next week and I'm trying to rearrange the backspace and once I clear out this hallway my electrician's gonna come back and work on more lights for me so we can see better now that it's cold and winter and dark is super early I lose a lot of my sunlight on the other side for light so let's move all this stuff down I don't think I'm able to clear out the hallway today but soon. The goal is in the future is to not leave a lot of stuff in the hallway because if I need to move stuff, it's too narrow to have two pallets side to side. So let's keep going. Maybe there'll be more chairs back there. These are possibly stools, but I have a feeling they're the wrong color. And I think there's four boxes because I've had people ask me before and I don't always know right away how many I have of a specific item because they would like all of them. This could be a full like kitchen set of four chairs. So let's open them and see what they are. Okay guys, we've made it through this complete palette. That's stuff down the hallway today, but I'm calling it a day. It's pouring outside, seven o'clock on a Friday. I think I should go home. But every time I say that, I keep working. So that palette's almost empty. The goal is Monday to have everything out of this whole hallway done. No one's asked to come in tomorrow to pick up any of their winning items, so there might be a Saturday where I'm not actually here. So the goal is for Monday is to clear out the rest of this hallway bigger stuff super easy to move and actually this cabinet and that cabinet are the exact same I opened with that one to make sure that it had all three pieces of the wood top this one is sealed completely zip ties all around it it's not been open I take pictures of the outside of where the tape meets that corner of the box and I move on the only problem is this guy is 184 pounds so I have to clear some space to get him down the hallway and that'll clear up three big boxes from here then next week we tackle the other six so that's it for now. 21 pallets. Haven't had a huge delivery like this in a long time, and it wasn't bad. By far, not my worst delivery. Thank goodness. You guys know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll talk to you next time.